Hi, welcome back everyone. In today's video, we will be looking at another feature for video translator. And this time I will be using CapCut because CapCut has a video translator. So let's launch our NordVPN first because we need to connect to a United States IP address. Otherwise, you can't see the feature. So if you don't have the feature, please watch my this video. Missing CapCut feature, video translator. So now we are connected to the United States. Then let's launch our CapCut. And previously I've been using HeyGen to do a video translator. And if you want, you can go and watch this video. This is generated by the HeyGen, which I think it does a pretty good job using HeyGen. So now I'll be using CapCut. So this is the video translator and this is not free. So you need to be a pro subscriber. And for the pro su subscriber, you still need the AI credit. If you subscribe to CapCut, they are giving you about 1,550 credit. I can't remember exactly sure one minute costs how many credit. But if you are just using this invite friend or this kind of thing to get your pro version, then this won't work. You have to buy the AI credit. We shall talk about that in other video. So let's start with the video translator. And I'll be using the same clip that I used in HeyGen. So that will be more accurate. So with that, I will just drag the Donald Trump speech into it and then because Donald Trump is talking in, in English, so I'll translate that to Chinese because Chinese is the language that I know. So I can know how accurate is the translation. And then we can click on this translate button over here. And then it'll tell you how many minutes and this duration is actually quite accurate. So we have to come back in nine minute time for this to load finish and then see the end result. From there, we can just edit it if you want. So like I mentioned for HeyGen, the issue here was HeyGen you can only do from English to another language, but you can't edit. So if there's any error, you cannot edit the translation. Whether you're translating from Chinese to English, English to Chinese, Chinese or English to another language, sometimes there's a translation error and you can't edit it with HeyGen. So let's take a look at the CapCut and if you are able to edit, but I can tell you this uh, for CapCut, we can't edit the translation as well. Let me pause the video and come back when it is done. Okay, so our translation have been done. So let us just take a look now. And we can play it and we can edit, edit it or export it. What I'm looking for is how accurate is the translation and how good is the voice cloning of Donald Trump. So let's take a look. With a Banjo Lao Nian Ren. 我们将不对社会保障福利征税我不知道我在想对于餐馆工人来说所有工人小费工人小费不征税但是社会保障不征税因为他们已经把他们赶出了企业这些人所遭受的痛苦他们做了他们用正确的方式做了事情他们不停的储蓄通货膨胀摧
thing that we have to change in the transcript if you were to actually use it. But the problem is that you can't change the voice because this is generated by CapCut. CapCut don't allow you to change. So you have to take it as it is. So if I were to do a auto caption here, since we translate to Chinese, then the spoken language is Chinese and then we generate a auto caption. At the very most, what you can do is you can only change the caption. So let me use a more obvious font so you can see it. So that is the most you can do is you can change the word over here but by changing the word over here the voiceover remain the same okay let let me just put an example over here if you listen to the audio again okay this this word maybe you just listen to the last three word and then i will just change it so I'll just change it. Sorry. So I'll just change this one. And then I'm putting all the same three words. But when we play it, with a bunch of old people, Donald Trump voice don't change accordingly to this. Unless we are going to use a text to speech, and then we have to use a different person voice unless we clone Donald Trump voice into our cap card which that can be done actually that can be done I will talk about that in another video but for now this is what cap card generated out so between HeyGen and cap card I will prefer HeyGen because HeyGen is more accurate in the next video, I'll be talking about another tool which is much better than HeyGen and CapCut and it can edit the transcript and clone the voice. So watch out for the next video and if you like the video, please click on the subscribe button. And I will see you on the next video. Thank you.